Hi, my name is Abe Osman and I have multiple sclerosis. Um, I opened a GoFundMe account because I was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis when I was 16. Uh, just to shed a bit of light on the story, I, my sister was living in Egypt and she needed help moving the children back to Canada. So I, um, I offered my help. So it was about grade 11, summertime, and I got on the airplane going to Egypt, and I'm not sure when, but somewhere along that flight my legs went numb. And as a kid, you know, you don't really take it in. So I didn't tell anybody the whole trip in Egypt that I couldn't feel my legs. And when I got home, I went to, the, to my mom and I told her, I said, Mom, I can't feel my legs. And she said, come on, man, you're lying to me. So I lifted up my pants and I told her, pinch me. I promise you, I can't feel you. And she pinched my leg and she pinched it until it bled. And she started crying. And so I went to the doctor, got an MRI, and there was the MS. And um, MS is a tricky disease to deal with. It, um, it more or less takes everything. It's, uh, it attacks your spinal cord and your brain, which is more or less the powerhouse of everything. So I used to tell a joke to my friends. They would ask me, you know, how does it feel to have MS? And I say, do you remember when we used to go to house parties? And they said, yeah. I said, do you remember that one guy who was too drunk? He said, yeah. I said, MS is the guy who comes to the party and he's drunk and he just messes with everybody. Doesn't leave your kidneys alone, doesn't leave your eyes, doesn't leave your arms, doesn't leave your hands. It's hitting everyone different. But more or less, it's taking everything. And, um... There's a lot of, I, I personally, I kept my MS secret for like 10 years. I just recently decided to tell everybody, um, when you have MS, man, it's, uh, in the beginning, it's, it's real easy to hide, you know, a lot of these feelings are internal, the shocks in your legs. You know, your eyes start to fade, you know. And, um, there's a lot of people with MS who are hiding it, man. When I came out and told everybody, there's a lot of people who messaged me on Facebook and just said, yeah, I got MS too. People I went to school with, I didn't know. They kept the secret too. It's just, it's eating Canada. Everyone's getting it. Everyone's getting it. And, um... I just want you guys to know that, like, you never know what someone's going through. That a person could have lost their mom. You never know. So um, spread love. You know, be good, and, be good and decent to people. So um, my plans with this GoFundMe are to go. And get a surgery in, a, well, not a surgery, a procedure in Germany using chemotherapy and stem cells. And what they do is uh, they give you uh, chemotherapy. Well, first they take uh, stem cells from your blood or something, I think from your bone marrow. And then they give you two weeks of chemo, really, really serious chemo, wipe out your immune system. Then they give you stem cells, rebuild your immune system, and God willing, you'll be all right, right? So, I'm putting up this video, I'll be putting them up every week, letting you know about the progress, man. And then, see, right now I'm sitting down, but you never know, I could be standing up back to who I was. And I hope you're going to be with us on this journey. I hope week after week, I'll get closer and closer to that $80,000 goal, and God willing, everything will be alright. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your time. I wish you bless.
I wish you peace, spread love, be decent, and smile. Have, have a great day.